was the drinking age when you were 21 or 18? I'd be 21, but I was high school. I know I, you've heard, I've heard you talk about near beer. Was that available to you, or that was driving south to meet Missouri to get to buy 3% low alcohol beer? No. Or was that in college? Age 21 was legal. I don't think I had near beer, but we get 3% beer. That's what I mean. You have to go to Colorado to get that oh, okay. Coors beer. Okay. That was 3%. But in high, so what, high school, we didn't. What was, your, what was the hooch in high school? If you were going to be misbehaving at a dance, was, it, was there moonshine? Was there ditch weed? <clears throat> were you raiding the parents' booze, booze cabinet? Was there a store that would sell beer? Was there near beer? What, what did 17 or 18 year old kids do in Washington? Well, I tell you, Michael. And you, I, not you, I mean friends that you knew of. I think. Friends that you had heard about. You posed a very good question there, <laughs> and you did it very well. And I'm hearing names of liquors that I've never heard before. So, to you watching, I can't wait to interview him, because he knows more about some of the stuff than I do. Yes. Answer, we did not drink. I can recall really? a senior, in, I was a senior in high school, a friend of ours who was well, junior in high school, senior had a neat car, and we, were, we wanted to get beer, so we had to go to Danport, Iowa, which is an hour away, and we went in his car and bought beer and drank it all the way back. And there were no freeways, so this is back. No, it was two lane. State two highways. Lane. Yeah. And that's, and I remember I must have had three or four beers that night coming back. He was driving when we were. We got back fine and nothing happened, but I drank beer. And I remember the next morning, I didn't feel good. <laughs> and I went, I went to school, and even at noontime, I didn't feel good. But anyway, we didn't drink beer. Really? Liquor? I don't think I drank liquor in high school. I think I remember drinking uh, wine at the table. Oh, okay. Uh, they'd have it. I'm trying to think of the brand for wine now. Probably never forget it. Once a year, Easter Sunday. Mm -hmm. David. Oh, good David. We'd have a little beach kid got a little glass. If I drank beer more than that one night, I don't remember. So I'm guessing I probably did two or three times. Drinking was not but a Put another deal. way, it wasn't that you and your group in Washington <coughs> didn't drink alcohol in high school. It just wasn't part of what you did. It wasn't part of what we Maybe did. very rarely. It would be a rare deal. Uh, yeah. Do you think that the college it changed? Do you think that was a product of the time? Or was it it was a very conservative county? And you know, it was Amish country was close by. Was you think was that the same experience your friends in college had, had in June in, in high school? So was that unique to Washington, Iowa, or do you think that was the way things were? at that time in America. You put a lot of things to cover out there. Okay. I think Washington was no more religious or good or bad than any other small town. Oh, what, 5,000 time? time? 5,000. I think it was the times. Uh, I don't know of anybody older or younger than me that went out and got a six pack of beer and drank mm -hmm. it every Saturday night or any group that did that. Uh, they just didn't. If they did it, if other kids were doing it, they kept it quiet from the general mm -hmm. population. Right. And I was kind of popular. You would have known. So I would have known. known. I would have known what's going you on. Known. It just wasn't going on. Just so, uh, Which, of course, all changes in college. But well, college is <laughs> it's a different, that's a different part of the interview. It was a, <laughs> a quick learning thing. And thank God I went to university and it turned into taught me very quickly. So within two weeks, I knew.